Hello and welcome to the Game of 5x spot. This is Let's Talk Football Transfer News. Now, it's understand that Wolfsburg want to do a deal with Bayern Munich for Luis Gustavo. Nothing's been announced about the price or anything yet, but I was expecting someone from the Premier League to go in for him. From certain rumours. That would be an interesting move if he comes over here. I think he's a class player. And also Steven Jotovic. Is on his way to Manchester to finalise terms with Manchester City. Now he's been at Florentina for four years. And I think he scored around 38 goals. Last season he had 13. This season he had 14. What do you think he's going to be like in the Premier League if he does actually finalise the deal? And also, let's go to the Wayne Rooney saga. Where David Moyes has been saying that he's going to be playing second fiddle. And Rooney's confused because he thought he was meant to be the first team and he don't know what's going on. It's like they don't want him, but it's like they do want him. Because of the profit that they're going to make from him selling the shirts and everything. That's probably why they don't want him to go. But then, Chelsea, Mourinho come out and said that he's, that's his only target. He don't need to do nothing else. He just wants Wayne. What do you think of that move? But then also, Arsenal... Wenger's been coming out and saying that Arsenal can afford him. Maybe hinting that they're going to go after him. He's looking out to see what happens in this situation. Now, Rooney wants to go, obviously. Man, you don't want him to go. It's the same with Suarez and Liverpool. And apparently Arsenal have upped their bid to 40 million for Suarez. After the 30 million bid got rejected. Now Liverpool have rejected the 40 million bid and said that they want 55 million. Because Cavani's worth 55 million. So obviously Suarez is. And it's all tit for tat really. It's just stupid. If the player don't want to be at your club, let him go. That's all I can say. So what do you think of them two stories right there? Wayne Rooney and Suarez. Leave them in the comments below. And also Manchester United are still waiting to hear from Barcelona about their bid for Cesc Fabregas. According to David Moyes. When I've heard that Barcelona have rejected the bid and said that they would take 31 million instead of what they offered, which was reported to be 25 million. But then, with the deal that Barcelona and Arsenal did for Fabregas, is that Arsenal get first dibs if they was to sell him. So if they accept a bid for Man U, obviously they got to go back to Arsenal say you're gonna pay the same and if they say yes well boy let's see what happens what do you lot think about that and flamingo are about to complete the signing of andre santos from arsenal after we don't really play too many games there and the psg president has come out and said if barcelona meet Diego silva's buyout clause He's going to do the same with Messi's buyout clause. He's just going to go wham. 250 million euros in your face. And then Bar- Barca are going to accept it. And Messi's going to go, nah, I don't even want to go to you. See you later. So that's all pointless. Higuain's coming out saying that Mourinho wants to take him to Chelsea. Now, 
after all the speculation of him going to Arsenal and everything I don't know what's going to happen there it's a bit nuts but yeah that's about it really I will go into further older stories but most of you probably already know about most of them But I'll leave off with the Crystal Palace signing of Jose Campana. Woo! Got a little wonder kid right there. Let's see what he does next season in the Premier League. Hopefully we can stay up. But yeah, let me know the signings that I've spoke about. Let me know what the signings that you're really interested in seeing. Ones that you think that are going to happen. And how your club's going to do in the upcoming season. Only about four weeks away from there now. Just under. So yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. And take care. Have a nice day. Peace.